how to write an essay is very very important topic most of the students stuck and they get low band and i was writing very little task too how to write an essay right they mostly face the difficulties regarding their grammatical structure as well but they are also unaware of the formal and professional structure that should be followed for professional essay right now like if commonly we give or we assign any topic to students they would deal it with in a common sense in a common way right in a common sense mean in a common way like that would be commonly followed by every student by each and every aspirant right but if you would go if you would choose the professional way of writing essay that would increase you that would boost your score boost your uh, band as well as that from that structure you can achieve the highest 7.5 or 8 band very easily right so there is a proper professional structure to be followed so far for ice writing task to module and that is like whether that is opinion essay descriptive essay persuasive essay expository essay doesn't matter like in all kinds of essay as in task 2 they will ask you examiner will ask you to write an essay of 250 words the first thing is that your target should be to write to 70 words within four paragraph first paragraph introduction last paragraph conclusion now whatever the kind of essay is that expository descriptive persuasive um, the other opinion argumentative adventure whatever the guy you are supposed to know the formal and professional structure and like the the, the the perfect structure of introduction paragraph as well as conclusion paragraph these two structures should be followed so far in all kinds of essay because in all kinds of essay you are supposed to write introduction and then conclusion within introduction and conclusion within between these two paragraph you would write one paragraph body one and the other body two that would be depends on the, like that those two paragraph would depend on how you convey your ideas regarding the title regarding the topic that is assigned to you right now let's suppose we are going through the example that would move that is going to clear it more hundred percent to you guys like how to deal with any essay in a professional way the topic is not suppose i'm going to choose this topic for you people electronic reading is trending nowadays now mostly commonly if i ask any student uh, any aspirant to write an essay on this topic electronic reading is trending nowadays now they would write it in a way like commonly commonly they would take a start like this electronic reading is trending nowadays and it is because of like uh, uh, like everyone is having a very good approach to social sites and some social uh, you can say electronic devices right i am of the opinion that there are a lot of advantages and disadvantages which will be discussed in this now this is common structure it may seem to you like how beautifully he has elaborated so far right no 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 this is common structure the professional structure tells you to first the first thing is to mention ground in introduction like these were containing like the, the, the lines which i utter so far for introduction of this topic electronic reading is standing nowadays were around about four to five or six lines most probably now how you can the first target how you can write 60 to 70 words in introduction paragraph and decide that now not to only hit the target rather how you can follow the professional structure of introduction paragraph now the professional structure tells you to first the first thing to write a ground what is the base of the topic what is the rule for that topic the first your the first target the first goal the first point you should do it to write a proper ground for each topic now ground means the root root means the base base means what where this topic from where this topic has sorted out from where this topic has taken out by the by an examiner right now electronic reading is trending nowadays the root the ground for this topic is education because reading is having an affiliation with education right now you can easily write education as a ground now for education you are supposed to write two sentences on education this is the beautiful way to convey an idea to an examiner that sir or man right now i am going to write in a such a in such a way that my topic is actually having an affiliation with this base right reading so reading is having affiliation or relation with education now you would write two sentences on education in this way Education plays a vital role in society. Because of education, we can stop some criminal activities. Ace for Ace. Now on your topic. You just see how beautifully you have started your essay. Otherwise, you may directly start like all the other common uh, experience. Electronic reading is standing nowadays and it is because advantages. No, 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 no. 
that if you start like the, just look at just compare both the ways if you start in this way education plays a vital role in human life because of education we can stop some criminal activities now you are you are going to move towards your topic a is for a is electronic reading is concerned r screen reading is concerned it is increasing day by day now the first step in professional essay you are supposed to go through back to ground the ground means that what is the base of that topic after writing two sentences move or jump towards the uh, you can say background after ground background and background means paraphrase each statement whatever the statement is given to you just paraphrase that statement in your own words paraphrase means to write a similar statement within synonym to write a synonym statement so, sorry similar statement within different words having same kind of message having same kind of meaning having same kind of information having same kind of uh, uh, opinion right you are supposed the first point to write ground in essay in the introduction paragraph two sentences are intro with an introduction paragraph and should be written so far on the ground next step is to write your background background means now you are concerned or your focus should be gone to the uh, you can say the topic and topic should be written so far in paraphrase form in synonymized form why why in synonym why not the same words whatever the examiner has given to you so far to what well, believe me when you write an answer when you write the same topic within your synonym words this influence examiner this impress examiner this thing conveyed to examiner that this person is able to convey his or her idea in a lot of different ways right that's why i ask my aspirant to also use synonyms within speaking module for all the question and within writing module as well right now first thing was ground second thing was to paraphrase your statement our statement was electronic reading is trending nowadays now to convert this statement and paraphrasing form and uh, like in the synonym form we can say as for as instead of electronic reading with the synonym words we can say screen reading or pdf reading or soft reading or electronic reading right instead of electronic reading i would say as for as screen reading is concerned now they mention that it is trending nowadays you can say it is inclining nowadays it is increasing nowadays it is rising up day by day right you can also uh, change the uh, nowadays to day by day every day yeah in today's world right in this modern era now these are different word different phrases by using such word by using such phrases you can convey very beautifully the similar message to examiner that sir or ma'am i am able to convey this idea in some other words as well right this is going to have a very good impression on an examiner so you must go you should go for this pattern the first professional pattern to write it down the second professional pattern to write background the third professional pattern for introduction essay for introduction of any essay is to write your thesis to write your opinion to write your perception to write your information or what you think so far right now the third step your opinion now we can say i am of the opinion that the increase that has happened so far in electronic re uh, reading it is because that everyone is having very good approach to some social sites or ha huh, like uh, some uh, you can say new inventive devices right new social devices now first step ground second background third i also share my opinion now whenever remember it whenever there is a need of sharing opinion in an essay you are supposed to also give proof for it to prove it right and the proof for this opinion is an example this is a reason this is a reason in the way of reason you are supposed to share your example like i am of the opinion that screen reading is increasing day by day and it is because like everyone is having very good approach to it for instance for instance now example should be given from society right example would be given then after example just look this is only introduction paragraph a professional way a professional structure to be followed so far to get the highest band right now after writing uh, you can say your thesis your opinion now you are jumping to your example and after example now you would mention this essay is going to elaborate or discuss some advantages and disadvantages of screen reading that is increasing day by day now just look how beautifully your starting was 
how beautifully you closed your paragraph starting closing would like when the starting and closing would be this much attractive and impressive in front of examiner believe me they cannot cut your score right this is the professional structure for writing any introduction within any paragraph as well as sorry within any essay right now body one moving towards body one body one means paragraph number one after introduction it should again be started with topic sentence but this topic sentence should be now uh, yeah uh, one another thing like uh, most students also get stuck and confused in writing advantages along with disadvantages within single a single paragraph no 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 if this is opinion essay you are supposed to write advantages within one paragraph body one disadvantages in body two otherwise if this is problem and solution essay problem in body one solution in body two if that is agreement and disagreement essay agreement in body one disagreement in body two right now you are let's suppose you are dealing with advantages and disadvantages now in the first sentence you would write um, you, you can start it with such kind of uh, sentences uh, phrases connectors like admittedly electronic media is having a lot of advantages as far as it is concerned for instance we can get a lot of information we can get a lot of PDF books we can get a lot of books without having a pain for that we can say or that no, 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 you are actually sharing a lot of advantages and now to connect all these sentences you are supposed to share admittedly you're supposed to write addition in addition additionally logically first but all the connectors should show that this is advantage page an advantage paragraph right what paragraph you are writing what paragraph you are going through this should clearly be understandable to an examiner by using only your connectors that this is advantages paragraph after writing advantages paragraph you are again supposed to close your paragraph through closing sentence it can be closed in this way and some of we reach on the conclusion that there are a lot of advantages of uh, electronic media huh? electronic reading sir now moving towards body two and body two you supposed to start with some other connectors like on the darker side on the country side on the dorsal side you can say um, uh, like regrettably right you all these connector would show and would clear to an examiner that this person right now would discuss such kind of an idea right now when you are going to share again your uh, connecting ideas disadvantages within this paragraph disadvantage body two paragraph you are supposed to again use some dorsal side connectors like on the dorsal side, on the other hand, on the contrary side, right? this kind of connector will show actually like now you are going to discuss some disadvantages, some other opinions regarding your topic, right? Again, you would close your paragraph within a very beautiful way, within a beautiful way. This should be 100% clear to you where you started, where you close, where you started, where you close. That each better, right? Now, when you are done with body one, introduction, body two, right? With all these three paragraphs, moving towards conclusion paragraph, you are supposed to do two things first is restatement the another thing is recommendation the re restatement word this means that whatever you have written so far just give a restatement for that like this thing has so far discussed in this essay like a lot of advantages and disadvantages we see so you just you're supposed to give it a uh, like to write it in within around about four or five lines after restatement conclusion down no, no, this is also a proper structure formal structure for writing a conclusion do not write like directly what i have written so far in essay and now to summarize it no 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 no, no. this is not a way again first you wrote restatement restatement with whatever you have written so far and your essay advantage disadvantage and uh, the introduction paragraph just elaborate it in four or five lines writing after writing restatement give your recommendation recommendation like if it would be done so far and this way it would have a lot of advantages or disadvantages right and if it can be done like this it is essential it is beneficial this is called professional way of writing any essay and if you would follow it believe me even if you would have nothing if you would have no knowledge regarding any topic you can still go get a very good band a very you can say very good score for writing any essay writing on any topic you can achieve very good score by following this structure so this structure should be followed so far for getting the as uh, you can say the highest band right so this was all regarding ielts writing tasks two modules how to write an opinion essay especially argumentative essay and how to 
uh, like follow the professional structure, the formal strategy.